Is it possible to learn dice stacking in under 10 minutes? According to some recent studies, you can go from zero to stacking four dices in half an hour to an hour. Well, let's go to the chase. Dice stacking is a performance art similar to juggling or sleight of hand, in which the performer scoops dice of a flat surface with a dice cup and then sets the cup down while moving it in a pattern that stacks the dice into a vertical column via center pedal force and inertia. Well, you can't do dice stacking with just a random cup and some dices. You actually need the right equipment. Should have told me that two weeks ago. <laughs> But how is dice stacking actually done? Okay, so first approach the dice at a 45 degree angle, sharply switch directions as you strike the dice as it rises to the top, hold the cup at an almost 90 degree angle, repeat this process until all the desired dice are in the cup. It is similar to cradling a lacrosse ball. Yeah, I'm just gonna figure it out myself. 10 minutes starting from now, and the first thing I will do is try and get comfortable with the dice as part. Oh my God, here it is. I'm telling you. Okay, okay, well, it's still spinning. Um, you see, you've clearly seen that. I just rewatched the clip and realized what I was doing wrong. So I wasn't giving the dice enough space to go underneath the cup. So this led to the dice hitting the edge of the cup and didn't have space for it to go underneath the cup. So the consequences of this being, whenever I hit the dice at full force without enough space to go underneath the cup, it would just fly off. So why did it work that time? Well, because like the explanation said earlier, when you put the cup at a 45 degree angle and hit the dice at full speed, the dice will just automatically go inside of the cup. And that's exactly what it is without even doing it on purpose. So now I'm just going to get the feel of the dice in the cup and see wherever we go next. Okay, so now clearly I can grab the dice with one cup and let it stay in the air. So now we're going to try and do that with two dices. Okay, so the difficult part about this is I don't know if I should keep them close together to make it easier, which clearly not, because that almost made me blind. Or if I should try grab one at a time like this. But then the difficult part isn't just grabbing the dice, because that's probably the easiest part according to some studies. But the hardest part is actually stacking them inside of the cup. Because of course, it's, it's not that hard to grab a dice by the end of the day, because that clearly just took me like a minute and a half, two minutes to learn. But the hardest part is stacking these inside of a cup, so without seeing anything. So uh, let's just try that, because we're running out of time. No! No! Yes, we managed to stack two dice. Let's go! So now that I can manage not to just grab one dice, but grab two dice at the same time, and then actually being able to stack them is incredible. So now that I can manage to stack two dice, how about three? What do I need? Distance or closer? Let's try close. Nope. Distance. Nope. Yes! Three dices! It was about time we added some color. The hardest part so far is trying to keep all of the dices together while trying to grab that last dice. Because of course, the more dices in the cup, the harder it is to manage all of them. I tried. Oh my god, yes! Four in a row, four in a row! Okay, so this is gonna have to be the quickest recap so far because I only have like a minute and 30 seconds left. Anyway, we managed to stack the four dices. Now last level, five dices in a row. Goodness, am I that good at doing four? Oh my god, I'm done. I have 30 seconds left on my timer, so this actually might be my last shot to get it. 
Yes! Yes! Okay, and finally answer the question, is it possible to learn dice stacking under 10 minutes? And the answer is yes. Follow me for more videos and let me know what you want me to learn next. Peace out.